Well, a trip through commerce today may have felt like a trip back in time. It's the 78th anniversary of LA's Zoot Suit Riots, and today a rolling commemoration honoring the victims of those riots took place. NBC4's Michelle Vias has the story. To be a zoot suiter takes a lot of style and moxie. You, you have to have the, the, the pants with the creases, you have to have your chain, you have to have your hat, you have to have that strong attitude. There's even some uh, Pachuco language. You're looking firme, is that how we say it? Yeah, firme, yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing a Pachuco suit. Um, I actually got, I found this at Goodwill. Yeah. Yeah, so when I saw it, I right away I already knew what to, how to wear it. Stacy Adams. And you got these uh, pantas right here, the chain, it's the culture, it's the era. From back then, it's forgotten. But this Chicano style combined with jazz jackets borrowed from the African-American culture wasn't always accepted. It was illegal because of the fabric. There was a lot of uh, racism. If you wore a zoot zoot during June 3rd to June 9th, you would get beat up. June 3rd, 1943 would mark the beginning of the Zoot Suit Riots, which pitted American servicemen stationed in Southern California against young Latino and Mexican-American residents. We were at war with the Japanese and Germans, and here we are at war with our own people over a, a Zoot Suit, which is material, materialistic. Today, more than 100 lowriders and motorcycles lined up with pride in commerce this morning, cruising out to downtown LA to commemorate the 78th anniversary of the Zoot Suit Riots. Chicanos, you know, we take it slow, you know, nice and easy. You know, we're not in a hurry. We don't want to show off and race and all. We just cruise, cruise. And that, that's what led to the low riding. Back in the days, it was very dangerous to, to low ride. Also, also, it was very dangerous to even cruise because they'd get pulled over and you would get stopped, you'd get harassed all the time. Now it's more accepted. Now the, now the cops don't have harass you like they used to. Now they're here helping you out. My brother got me into it in high school back in uh, 84. And I love the car since then. And, you know, I'm, I'm here and I'm my grandson, my daughter. They're picking up after me. We want to make sure that whatever happened in the past doesn't happen again. I remember history because history is important. Never forget what happened in the past so it can be better in the future. Peace out. We're all one at the end. We all got to be one at the end. There's enough for everybody. In commerce, Michelle Vias, NBC4 News.